Hey guys, so this is like 12 30 in the morning, and I'm with daddy. I should have while I'm at home. I told you that daddy doesn't sleep until like 4 a.m. in the morning, and this is like past 12, and he's still not even feeling sleepy at all. Uh, daddy, thank you so much, sir. You're yeah, welcome. <laughs> The video you just watched is um, that your Israel. I think that's the uh, APC youth leader that was saying, but I'm at Tinubu does not sleep. That he was in his house at four at um, four p.m. and he's still not sleeping because of national issue. <laughs> it's actually very funny because why you say someone does not sleep, but he will go for public events and he will be dozing off. It is already clear to the blind that Tinubu is not fit for this job and I don't know the people that are pushing this man that are pushing this agenda that he should run and you are shouting on your mandate to stand the person you are standing on his mandate cannot even stand no as if he can't even stand he's sleeping on his seat so well at this point right like the our video I made uh, yesterday that the former president just said only on patriotic nigerians we vote for bola metunubo the former president was spot on and he was saying the truth so if you are watching this video and you are still thinking that you have coconut head you must vote for bola metunubo maybe you should have everything i won't condemn you i won't cause you anything because it's your right to decide wherever you want to uh, vote for but if you won't be proud of the choice you want to make on february 25th 2023 in the next eight years when you look back then change your mind peter obi was in southern kaduna today for another presidential campaign rally like um in kaduna kaduna is a state in the northwestern part of nigeria and Kaduna is divided into two Northern Kaduna and Southern Kaduna. The Northern Kaduna are majority Muslims and the Ka Southern Kaduna are majority Christians. Peter Bay has done campaign, presidential campaign rally in Kaduna before, but that was in Northern Kaduna because his vice, um, the uh, professor Dati Baba Ahmed, is from Northern Kaduna, he's from Kaduna, but the Northern Kaduna part. And now the major support base of Peter being Kaduna is the Southern Kaduna. So he was there today and you could see there, there were a lot of people that were that they were happy to come out and uh, receive Peter Obi. And one one propaganda that has been flying around is that the North will not vote for an Igbo man or the North will not vote for a Christian candidate or they make it seem that the North they are just majority Muslims or they are 90% Muslim but that's a lie the North they, are, they, are, they, are, they have multi ethnic groups a lot of ethnic, ethnic groups even more than the South and these small small ethnic groups they are mostly being marginalized they are being killed and bullied by the uh, the Fulanis and the Avusas up North the bad ones we are not saying all full lines and officers are bad but the 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 art flows or the full and the and the and the officers they bully the 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 minorities in the north so now if you are contesting for for presidency and uh, you there are this set of people that have been marginalized in the north you can easily get their vote because they, they call it a sympathy vote, they call it emotional, you can, you can easily appeal to the emotions that okay, we know you guys are minorities in this place and you have been maltreated. If you all minorities come together and give us your vote, we will make sure that this majority, they don't bully you. So that's part of um, politics, because politics is a game of numbers and you have to work on your strength. So that's mostly what Southern Kaduna is and many people believe okay, they feel that the north is like a majority muslim but no the north has up to 40 percent christians and they are being marginalized too they are being killed like sada kaduna i made a video about sada kaduna killings where bandits to enter their community they will kill like 
they kill not less than 20 people per week in South Kaduna. They bury people daily in South Kaduna. And the governor that ran a Muslim Muslim ticket doesn't see anything. He doesn't even send condolences. He will still impose he will impose an emir, which is a Muslim leader, a, like a Muslim king, on a Christian dominated community. So there has been a lot of ethnic cleansing up north and uh, these minority groups they have to come together and vote against the party which has been victimizing them so the whole propaganda that do not vote for apc or, or the apc have one kind of uh, they have a kind of uh, male, a kind of block votes that is waiting for them is a lie and it's a propaganda so this video has this bit of this visit to zada Kadna has actually shown that do not will vote for or credible candidates if proper campaign is being done up there thank you for watching my video kindly like my video and subscribe to my youtube channel bye for now